Hello to everyone. In this video, I am going to explain how to plot and perform various operations in a cylinder on MATLAB. For that, first of all, you need to write certain commands CLC clear all, close all, just to clear the command window. Now, you are going to take an input from the user using the input command and ask the user to enter the radius of a cylinder which he want to plot on a MATLAB. That value will be stored in R. Cylinder is basically a three dimensional figure having x, y and z coordinate. We have a cylinder command in MATLAB to plot a cylinder. x, y, z cylinder r. Now we are going to plot the same on a command window. For that we are going to use mass command mass x, y, z. We will run the program, enter the radius, we will enter 5. And you can Here you can see the output on the command window, a cylinder of radius 5 and height 1. Now, if you want to have a color on the surface, then you need to make use of surf command. There are basically two types of command, mass and surf to plot this three dimensional figure. Now, if you want to change the color of this cylinder, then you need to write face color. And then after that, you need to write the color you want. Suppose I want a green color, so I will write green. And now I will run the program. Enter the radius 5. Here you can see the color is green. Now the height is 1 here. If you want to change the height, then first of all you will ask user to enter the height. Now user will enter the height and it will be stored in the edge. By default the height is 1 in any figure in MATLAB. Now we are going to change it. For that we need to write Z 1 Z1 semicolon equal height which the user has entered. Now if I going to run this program. Enter the radius 5, enter the height 5. Here you can see that the height has been changed to 5. We can also make use of any other function inside the cylinder. Suppose if I want to plot cost e inside the cylinder that can be done like this cylinder cost e. So we are going to implement same here. The first of all we need to define the interval of t. Here we are taking a t from 0 to 2 pi and the interval is of pi by 10. So cost e will be plotted for one cycle. Now cos t cylinder is three dimensional figure so it will have three coordinate x1, y1, z1 and we will use cylinder command to plot it. Initially we will do it using r, r here is cos t. Now subplot is a command to plot anything on the command window. Subplot 2 comma 1 comma 1. Now mess is command to print a mess on the command window, mess x1, here enter the radius 5, enter height 5, here you can see the output, this is a mess. Now here we have used r, in place of r you need to use cos t, first of all you change it to surf, this will print the surface, now let me show you the difference between them. First of all, you need to change the value of this R to cos t. Now subplot 2 comma 1 comma 2 surf x2. Sorry, surf y1 subplot 2 comma 2 comma 1 surf z1 subplot 
टू कॉमा टू कॉमा टू सर्फ एक्स वन वाई वन जेड वन वी कैन प्लॉट ऑल दीज थ्री फिगर्स इन अ वन गो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सी द आउटपुट ऑन कमांड विंडो इन टू द रेडियस फाइव हाइट फाइव है यू कैन सी द सेकेंड फिगर इज द लास्ट वन विच इज द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ थ्री इन अ वर्टिकल डायरेक्शन नाउ इफ आई वॉन्ट टू फ्लिप इट इन द ओरिजेंटल डायरेक्शन दैन वी नीड टू मॉडिफाई द कोड द लास्ट लाइन सर्फ एक्स वन वाई वन जेड वन विल बी मॉडिफाई बाई स्वैपिंग एक्स वन एंड जेड वन नाउ इट विल बी फ्लिप्ड ओरिजेंटली इन टू द रेडियस फाइव हाइट फाइव है यू कैन सी द आउटपुट इट इज फ्लिप्ड ओरिजेंटली